welcome back to my channel. I know I haven't made videos in a really long time, and now I am back with a haul. Um, it's kind of a, like a mini collective haul. I haven't really gathered enough items to make a haul until now, so here it is. Um, I'm not wearing any makeup if you're wondering, so like don't ask what's on my face because there's nothing on my face. Other than like eyeshadow for my eyebrows because my eyebrows are a hot mess. Um, ew. And sorry for my nails. They're really plain and ugly. Ugh. I don't know. I just gross. I've been like so busy lately like, breaking nails and ugh, I just forgot the nail polish. Just forget it. And hair. I know my hair has been up in the past three videos, two videos. I don't know. I'm sorry. Um, my hair has grown to a length that I don't like and I want to style it and get it recolored and all this other stuff because right now it just looks gross. And that's why it's always been up. So anyways, I will start off with what I got um, at the drugstore. Um, my local drugstore had a huge 40% off on Wet n Wild um, products and I just kind of had my own little splurge moment. I didn't really get that much. So I got four color icon pots. Um, this one is in Don't Steal My Thunder. Um, by the way, three of these four color icon palettes are going to be given away in my upcoming giveaway. So this would be a great smoky color. Um, this one is in Knock On Wood. This one is in I'm Feeling Retro. And I myself got my self. I myself got myself. I myself got one of these too, and I'll just do a quick swatch. I love Wet n Wild eyeshadows. They have really good pigmentation, and they're not chalky. So I'll just do a quick swatch for you. This is what they look like. This is the I'm Feeling Retro palette. Okay. And then I also just got two nail polishes. This is the Wet n Wild's Mega Last um, polish in On a Trip. Um, it's just a periwinkle purple. And I don't know, it's a, a new collection, and they have some interesting claims that this is like salon quality. Um, I'm definitely going to go back and do a review on this and go back and buy some more. Um, I also just got a Top Coat Wild Shine Clear Nail Polish from Wet n Wild. This one was like 99 cents. 40% of that was, I don't know, I'm not going to do the math, but less than like 50 cents. I don't know. <laughs> I don't get. Okay, now I'm just. I've gone blank. Okay, I'm just gonna stop talking. Anyways, I'll just go right into my Elf haul. Elf haul. My Elf products. I didn't really buy anything um, out of the ordinary. I guess it's nothing compared to my normal, my regular Elf hauls, where I just buy products to try. These I kind of wanted to stick for purpose, I guess. So I got this. Elf eyebrow kit in the dark comes with a gel and a powder. I've heard lots of raves about this, so I wanted to try it out because um, I've hit pan on the eyeshadow that I used for my eyebrows, so I just figured I should just go into a new routine. Um, and then I got this matte bronze elf or this matte bronze healthy glow bronzing powder, and um, this is a lot darker than I thought it was going to be. I was gonna use it for contouring, um, but I could try it. I mean, it doesn't hurt to try. Maybe I could use a little bit of it. Because right now my bronzer for contouring is a little too shimmery. And I don't like too much shimmer. Or I don't like shimmer on my face or whatever. Um, then I got this Dramatic Lash Kit. I was going to go back into falsies. But I just kind of said forget it. Um, I'm not really feeling falsies right now. So I'm just going to go ahead and give it away. Um, yeah. So I'm just going to give that away. And I'll just go back and buy my own later. Um, I got three brushes. I got this eye crease brush right here. It's just a small brush for the outer V um, to just create looks. And then I got this eyeliner brush. It's my first brush that is an angled eyeliner brush. I saw a, I don't know who it is. Is it Fashionista 804? I saw a guru use a flat eyeliner brush like this to shape her eyebrows with the concealer and so it just seemed like I, I should try out that method because I have three eyeliner brushes but they're all angled so I just thought this would be a good idea to try and then I love their bamboo collection um so I got a blending eye brush and this is five bucks I mean this is the most I've ever spent on a brush I mean I have the powder brush from the bamboo collection too but uh yeah 
This is my first eye brush and it's really soft and interesting. Um, and then I just got a mineral eyeliner. It's just black, it comes in this little box and I'll just show it to you real quick. Um, okay, and then for, I got some stuff from Forever 21. Thanks to one of my subscribers named Ashley who sent me a Forever 21 gift card. She is so generous, it, generous, generous. And like, I was like, are you serious? Like this is not a scam or anything. But she sent me a Forever 21 gift card and I'm so appreciative of it. I got a few items, um, mostly sale items, so they're not too fancy smancy, but yeah. I'll just go ahead and go into the legwear. I got these tights. Um, it's just a nice fuchsia magenta color. Um, this is my first like pair of tights that are like this color because usually I just stick to neutrals and I haven't had anything like bright like this and I th thought this would be a great addition for spring. Um, I just got these navy blue ankle leggings. Um, really nice. Real nice, real nice. Um, jaw. Jaw. Not too special. Um, I got these really cute socks. They're polka dot and rose socks. I love ankle socks. I'm really comfortable. And though it was only 99 cents. I mean, 99, like 95 cents. So, yeah. Then I got this, uh, chiffon strapless blouse. Um, it's blue, purple, lavenders, and pinks, and greens. It's such a great piece for both spring and summer. I could probably wear this with leggings, and it has a sheer midriff, so I would probably wear something un or underneath it. Um, just strapless. It's just a really cute baby doll shape with the like cute ruffly pleats at the bottom. Um, just really cute. Um, and then I got this high-waisted skirt with horizontal stripes. I mean, I know people kind of stick away from horizontal stripes because it makes them look wider, um, but I don't know. I mean, I personally don't really have hips, so maybe I can benefit from, from this. This is something I wouldn't really normally go for, but I just thought it would be a great piece to just add to my collection, my collection, my wardrobe, and I thought it'd be nice to wear during the spring and summertime. Um, can fold it down as well. And this is only like five eighty, so it's just a really cheap price. So I don't know. Hopefully, I can rock this and like not look funny in it, funny in it, <laughs> funny in it. Um, and if I do wear it, I will show it to you in an outfit of the day or a lookbook or something. And which I'm meaning to do a lookbook for spring, but I haven't come up with enough pieces or outfits to show you guys. But once I do definitely will be up. Anyways, that's it for this haul video. Um, hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching and catch me in my next video. Bye!